Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel Mystic Holistic. I'm your host Dr. Vipha Pawar and today we're going to do a quick uh, tarot card reading for the month of February 2022 for the sign uh, Capricorn. Uh, let's just understand how the energies for the month of Feb are there for you Capricorn. Uh, also, just remember these are general readings so they may or may not resonate with all of you. However, if they do, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Spread the word. <laughs> okay, I'm going to move on. Let's see, just do the final shuffle and then we'll get to start. Okay, Capricorn. So, in your uh, recent past, you've got the Seven of Ariel. So, um, it, it's a card that says that you have invested wisely so far uh, in whatever uh, work you were doing or whatever relationship you were trying to build uh, as well. You have invested your time and wisely in, in that building that relationship or building uh, the opportunity or pro project that you were working on and you have now got the patience and wait for the harvest to come your way as well so right now most of you might be uh, might have already started experiencing the outcome of your investments or some of you might be patiently waiting to understand how the outcome is going to bang out to be so there is definitely a time for you guys to make some plan for your next endeavors most of you are in between projects right now, probably, or you're in between, or uh, you know, expanding your businesses or multiplying your businesses as well. Or this this could be a time period where you are, oh, you know, there were some challenges probably in your relationship. You guys have worked out on it together, and right now you're just you know giving it time, uh, to settle things down, and you're waiting for. Uh, outcome to understand that whatever measures that you have taken so far are they working or they're not working so that's with that energy you in your recent uh, current energies where we are we moved into five of Michael and we move into page of a uh, Michael so definitely uh, uh, some exciting new challenges are being offered to you and you have uh, what it takes to succeed in that um, but with the five of michael car there is a slight bit of a warning or something that you need to be cautious about uh, in um, considering the overall approach that you take towards the situation you might want to uh, thoroughly assess the situation before coming to any conclusions or before making any uh, uh, making any final judgments and making any final uh, taking any final calls on the situations probably so there is a there is a energy of uh, probably somebody is spying on you as well or somebody is watching you and you need to be aware of all your actions what actions are you taking and you you need to have or uh, assess all your actions thoroughly before you take a final judgment call you know so just a little bit of a warning over there that you need to be more aware about your surroundings about the people that you're dealing with and uh, then take a very conscious effort so although there is a challenge that has been represented to you but just keep in mind that you still have what it takes to overcome on those challenges so don't worry there there is a there is a period where you will feel that you know you have a difference of opinions coming into picture but you can come out of it um, as a victorious person because in your immediate future you got the six of gabriel now uh, that's a card of victory <laughs> so there is definitely 
time to move to a new project that's an uh, award scholarship or promotion that's coming up for you as well but there this is the energy where which in which you have to go through that as a process so that you can come out victoriously so anything that you're experiencing right now which is making you feel that um, oh god when is this going to get over so this is going to get over definitely for soon and it's going to be in your favor so you don't have to worry about it because things are going to turn out to be in your favor you're going to come out as victory and the truth will prevail itself you know the truth will come out so you don't have to worry about it or if there is there are certain situations uh, where you must have feel deceptive or lied to cheated to those are going to end for sure and the truth is coming out in your favor so just hold on you, you know go through that process but definitely in the near future you are coming out as a victorious person uh in your environment and your hopes and fears again you've got the five of aerial and uh, you've got the six of aerial so six of aerial is a card of uh, balance or uh, again it is a it's a card of victory as well because it uh, it talks about a uh, act of uh, kindness a selfless act some charitable work that you want to do or you know something something that is that is happening to you which will bring out that balance that you've been looking forward to so definitely there is a hopeful card to have and you've got the uh, five of aerial from the environment front you know so with this kind of an energy where you are feeling in a conflicting situation which is probably not serving you and there is a um a war that's going on in your head right now the environmental energy around you might you might feel that it is it is also not supporting but you know it's it's a perception management that you have to go through you are definitely in a challenging situation but you don't have to face it alone so the um, energy or the environmental messages that are coming in is like you need to ask for help only if you going to ask for help you want to get help so don't don't try to battle it around alone you are going to get support but you need to keep your pride and ego aside and seek for support and friendship so that's around the corner but you need to ask for it and um, you need to keep a uh, check on your negative thoughts uh, and you know because right now with this energy it is whatever you are thinking you know because of this situation those negative thoughts are attracting negative energies as well so probably in a vicious cycle where your current situation is leading to a negative thought but that negative thought is manifesting the current situation as well so you need to break that cycle you need to break that chain of thoughts and that that only you can do it nobody can you know uh help you on that because that's a self control that you have to establish for yourself and your thought process which will definitely help you break the chain and then you will be able to achieve the victory that you have always been looking forward to and the truth will come out in your favor so some self discipline on the thought process is definitely recommended for the month of feb uh also the overall outcome for this reading you've got the king of gabriel so there is a bigger picture you know you have to keep and keep your eye open for a bigger picture uh and leave the details to others you know experiences will lead you to success uh genuine concerns for others will help you build a relationship uh, where you uh, on a uh, strong grounds so or uh, there is going to be a little bit of drama around for the month of feb but um, try to look over and above the drama you know try to look for the genuineness that this uh, person is offering to you this could be a person who's coming in your life and offering you certain help in your uh, uh, in your current situation or this could be you who's going to be a self motivational person who's going to ensure that you know this is kind of like your higher self telling you 
to hold on to your ground and things will fall into place automatically so okay definitely some uh, period of struggle uh, or some period of new challenges that are coming uh, up your way or some 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 new projects that are coming up your way as well where you will be able to uh, be come out victoriously and you will be able to uh, you know get that long awaited promotion or long awaited award or recognition that you have been looking forward to for sure so just keep a little bit track on your money and financial aspects and or uh, if you're signing any new contracts and uh, documents or anything like that just uh, get it a uh, double check you know from uh, some professionals uh, because there is an energy of deception as well around so it's always better to have an additional opinion from the experts while making some important decisions on your life so definitely or uh, definitely reach out to connect people you know so that they can help you out uh, in the situation Okay, so let me just pull one oracle energy card and understand if there are any specific messages that you need to hear for the month of Feb. Okay, you've got the third chakra of or the solar plex I think it is so solar plexus chakra right? let's just see what the third chakra is, has the message for you Okay, so third chakra uh, represents the, your emotional emotions of desire and your life force energy. Uh, it is a solar plexus chakra, so I was correct on that one. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, the oh, uh, energy card represents that issues uh, here resolve around the emotions of desire and uh, your personal energy. So. When this card appears upright, it indicates that uh, an increased enthusiasm is present or soon to be present uh, on its way. This is a great time to move forward, uh, the completion of your desires. Your life force is vibrating with power and resonance and your soul is calling uh, you to direct your energy in a more focused and purposeful manner. So the angel of power is with you right now. So go for it. So that's a that's a good energy to have. So you have a lot of life energy around you, probably, and that will help you sail through the challenging situation that you might be going through right now. And that is how it is. It might be you know coming up or as a victorious position for you in future as well. So. Trust your gut feeling, definitely. This is the time to trust your gut feeling. Your gut feeling is the strongest right now. And uh, keep an eye or keep a check on your thought process. You know, don't fall in for the negative thought process and seek and help of an expert when you're uh, dealing with some important documentations or contract, you know, before signing on anything or before closing out on any new deals as well. So overall, uh, good month to be in uh, go with the flow <laughs> trust your guts and let's see how things will roll up for you in the upcoming months as well so thank you so much for listening to me if this has resonated with you please don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel i will see you in the next video thank you bye, -bye.